Welcome back, everyone. Today we have some significant updates regarding Iraq's economic landscape. Our trusted source, Intel Guru Walking Stick, has shared some crucial information about the recent changes in Iraq's financial management, specifically focusing on the actions taken by Prime Minister Sudani. In recent developments, Prime Minister Sudani has taken a proactive step by revising existing contracts and recalculating them to align with the new exchange rate set in the national budget. This move is crucial for several reasons. And it marks a significant shift in how Iraq is handling its economic policies. Firstly, let's talk about the implications of rewriting contracts to reflect the new exchange rate. By recalculating these contracts, the Iraqi government aims to ensure that all financial agreements are up to date and accurately represent the current economic conditions. This is especially important for international trade and investments, where exchange rates play a critical role. By aligning contracts with the new rate, Iraq is sending a clear message to its international partners that it is committed to transparency and economic stability. But why is this recalibration necessary? The answer lies in the dual budget system that Iraq has been operating under. According to Intel Guru Walking Stick, Iraq has been running two versions of its budget, one based on the new exchange rate and another on the old rate. This dual approach has likely been a strategic measure to transition smoothly from the old economic framework to the new one. By maintaining both budgets, the government can compare outcomes and adjust policies accordingly without causing abrupt disruptions. This dual budget strategy also highlights Iraq's cautious approach to economic reform. Changing an exchange rate can have wide reaching effects on the economy, affecting everything from import costs to inflation rates. By running two budgets simultaneously, Iraq can monitor the impact of a new rate while still having the old rate as a fallback option. This method allows for a more measured and controlled transition, minimizing potential economic shocks. Furthermore, this move indicates a broader trend towards economic modernization and reform in Iraq. The country has been working to rebuild and stabilize its economy following years of conflict and political instability. By updating contracts and aligning them with the current exchange rate, Iraq is laying the groundwork for a more robust and resilient economy. This action not only boosts investor confidence but also enhances the overall efficiency of the country's financial operations. It's also worth noting the broader implications for the Iraqi population. A stable and transparent economic environment can lead to improved living standards, as businesses can plan better and consumers can have more confidence in their financial transactions. This transparency is vital for fostering trust in the government's economic policies and can help drive long-term growth and development. In conclusion, Prime Minister Sudanese's decision to rewrite contracts and recalculate them in line with the new exchange rate is a pivotal step in Iraq's journey towards economic reform and stability. By running parallel budgets with both the new and old exchange rates, Iraq is demonstrating a cautious yet forward-thinking approach to economic management. This strategy not only enhances transparency and investor confidence but also sets the stage for sustainable economic growth. Thank you for tuning into this update. Stay tuned for more insights and analysis on Iraq's economic developments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content.